In this video, we will be going over 10 easy tasks to do to get Nook Miles fast. But before we get into that, if you like Animal Crossing tips and tricks that get straight to the point, then hit that subscribe button and ring the bell if you haven't already. Number 1. Bell Ringer For this task, all you need to do is go on a shopping spree at the Nook's Cranny. And you'll get Nook Miles just for spending bells. And you'll most likely achieve this Nook Miles achievement just by playing the game naturally. Because obviously you're going to want to buy really cool stuff for your island and decorate it, right? Number 2. Growing Collection For this task, all you need to do is fill up your catalog by collecting items. And one of the fastest ways to grow your collection of items is to attend some catalog parties. I plan on having some catalog parties for our community here in the near future. So if you would like to attend one of our catalog parties, feel free to join my Discord down below. Number 3. Shop It So this task requires you to buy items from the Nook Shopping Service, which can be found at the ATM. Once you've purchased 100 items from the Nook Shopping Service, you can actually get the Nook Shopping Service phone app on your phone, which makes it super convenient because then you won't have to go all the way to the town hall to order your item. You can only purchase up to 5 items per day from the Nook Shopping Service, so if you want to get this achievement done faster, you can actually order 5 items and time travel to the next day and just repeat that until you have 100 items. Number 4. Tomorrow's Trees Today I have to admit, I love spending time out in nature, which is why I want to keep my island looking natural and have a natural theme to it. So in order to do that, I just planted a ton of trees on my island. Best of all, we get nook miles for doing that. If we plant 30 trees on our island, we get 300, 500, and 1,000 nook miles in that order. And the cool part about this task is that this task is a lot faster to complete than some of those other tasks that may require hundreds of repetitive actions to get the nook miles. Number 5. Shrubbery Hubbery Shrub a dub dub <laughs> <laughs> oh god. This task is probably one of the easiest tasks to do in the game because this task requires a very low amount to get a lot of nook miles. All you need to do is plant 20 shrubs on your island and then you'll get 300, 500, and 1000 nook miles in that order. And you can get shrubs from Leaf. He's an NPC that randomly shows up to your island. Number 6. Have a nice DIY. Don't you just love the feeling you get when you get a new DIY? I know I do. Best of all, we get Nook Miles from just collecting the DIYs. Literally all we have to do is learn them and then BAM! Nook Miles. The rewards for this task are 300, 500, 1000, 2000, and 3000 Nook Miles in that order. And it's really easy to get DIYs. I actually have a complete step-by-step -step guide on my channel that will show you how to farm DIYs to get the maximum amount each day. Number 7. Good Things in Store So this achievement is another really easy one because all you have to do is store items in your home storage and you get Nook Miles. And as you progress more and more into Animal Crossing, you'll most likely get this achievement naturally. Because as your house gets bigger, so does your storage. And the rewards you get from this task are 300, 500, 2000, 3000, and 5000 Nook Miles in that order. Number 8. So this is another really easy one and incredibly useful if you're wanting to complete your Critterpedia. Literally all you need to do is dig up these little clams that are found on your beach. And you'll see them splurt like some water from the ground. That's how you know it'll be a clam. Not only is this a really easy way to get Nook Miles, but you can use these clams to craft fish bait which will help you catch more rare fish. You can get up to 300, 500, 1000, 2000, 3,000 Nook Miles in that order just from completing this task. I kind of wish there were some more things to do with these clams. I mean, wouldn't it be cool if we could make like some clam chowder or something? I don't know. Number 9. Flower Power Make your island look pretty and get a ton of Nook Miles with this task. Flowers are so cheap in Animal Crossing and it's really easy to plant them. Like it's probably like the easiest thing in the world. Like I'm, I'm being serious. <laughs> If you haven't planted any flowers yet, I don't know why you wouldn't, <laughs> I highly recommend doing so just to rack up the Nook Miles. You don't even have to keep the flowers if you don't want to, but I mean, I would, I would keep them because they look pretty. And the rewards for this task are 300 miles for 10 flowers, 500 miles for 50 flowers, 1000 miles for 100 flowers, 
2,000 miles for 200 flowers. And if you plant 300 flowers, you can get 3,000 nook miles. Number 10, flower tender. So once you've gotten all your nook miles from planting your flowers, you can get even more nook miles just by watering your flowers. The rewards for this task are 500 miles for 50 flowers watered, 1,000 nook miles for 100 flowers watered, 2,000 nook miles for 500 flowers watered, and finally you can get up to 3,000 nook miles for watering 1,000 flowers. The only downside with the flower power and the flower tender uh, task is that they require more repetitive actions than the tree task and the shrub task. So it may take you a little bit longer to complete these tasks and get the nook miles for these tasks right here. But nonetheless, they are very, very easy to do and they didn't really take me that long to do. But after I got those nook miles, it was totally worth it. If you vibe with the content, subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Peace.